Hey everyone, thanks for stopping back by Mike Foster Outdoors. Um, if you're new to my channel, please uh, check through some of my videos down through here. I've been doing this for a while. And uh, give them a look. And then maybe if you like some of my stuff, give me a thumbs up and a subscribe. Um, today's video is some practice footage from day one at Grand Lake. We went out there for stop number two of the Toyota um, Plains Division. And I had never been to Grand, but it was a really cool lake. Um, hope to get back out there again. Maybe if I fish the Toyotas next year, they'll have another stop out there. Um, tons and tons of pockets and stuff on that lake. Um, but this video, I wanted to share a few of my bigger fish catches from day one. And I also have some footage from the eclipse because we were out there fishing during the eclipse that day. I put my eclipse glasses over my camera lens and it worked decent but um beyond that i was just wanting to share these catches with you guys and maybe to help teach teach you a little bit of what i was keying on and i'll probably have three or four videos in this grand lake series because i got a lot of stuff from day two practice and then some tournament footage had issues with the camera during the tournament um where the plug goes from my yellow stick into the camera somehow that got really hot and um, my camera wouldn't run all day. I, I had to run the three batteries that I had and uh, they didn't go for more than probably four hours between those batteries. But um, let's get into this video guys. Um, thanks for stopping by again. Till next time, tight lines. Alright guys, we're starting uh, day one of practice here. It's uh, Monday morning and never been to Grand, so we're going to see what we can figure out. Got three days of practice to put something together. Tournament starts Thursday. Uh, if you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by and let's get after these fish, see if we can get one. Well guys, that didn't take long at all. <laughs> See what this sucker weighs. That's close to five pounder. Good grief.
sitting in here. Okay guys, I'm going to try to put my uh, eclipse glasses over the lens and see if I can share the star of this eclipse, but I'm going to try to get it while it's, uh, it's totally eclipsed later. Still got another hour or so before that. But I just looked at it and it's starting. So let's see if this works. Alright guys, it's down to where it's just a crescent before it's covered up all the way. You can tell that it's getting a lot darker. And I've caught two bass in this pocket. So uh, I'm going to put the camera back on the back after I show you this one more time. We're going to see if we can catch a bass while it's like close to dark. Okay guys, I seen this pocket when I was idling into this cut. Um, I was trying to focus on the cuts that were a little bit shorter on day one. I was focusing on them and maybe like the first couple cuts um, off of that main pocket. So I see this spot here and you can tell as I'm going into it. Um, I just thought, man, there's gotta be some fish that spawn in this. And you're gonna see what I caught out of there. I had a bite took my Cinco off and then I catch this one fish in there um, I'm pretty sure this fish was bedding it's a perfect spot for a spawner to be it's totally protected um, but I hope you guys enjoy this fish catch
Thank you.